Four games left in the Bundesliga, six points behind the leaders. It's mathematically possible. Two games today in an episode of Big Bad Wolfsburg. The Big Bad Wolf. Wolf. Welcome back to the Force Lanes YouTube channel. Welcome back to Big Bad Wolfsburg on Football Manager 2017. And today, two of the remaining four games in the Bundesliga, Stuttgart and Darmstadt. If you're enjoying this series, make sure you leave a like down below, leave comments, and if you want to see videos as on my knitting up on YouTube, hit that subscribe button. Nothing to go through off screen. We're pretty much going to jump straight into the first game, so hopefully a nice short video today. Before we do, let's have a look at the table and see what's happened. We're in second place at the moment. We're six points behind Bayern. We're a point ahead of Schalke and they've played a game more, so uh, we're looking good. Dortmund are eight behind us, so uh, if we get a win in our next game, then we'll secure a top three finish. We have qualified for the Champions League. Leverkusen cannot catch us, so we've got a top four finish, meaning that we've at least got a Champions League playoff next season. I'm not playing this next season. I might bring it back for a stream or something like that before FM18 comes out, but um, on YouTube, I'm not going further than this season. FM18, I'm going to start with Liverpool in case you didn't know. Okay, now we are a couple of days away from the fixture. We're going to have a chat with Mario Gomez because if we have a look at his form, he has not scored a goal since the start of February. So that is uh, over two months, almost three months without a goal. And that was against Ingolstadt. Hasn't scored since. He's had a lot of like sort of substitute appearances and you know he hasn't even been used in some games. But we're going to have a little chat with him and we're going to warn about recent form. But we're going to say, you haven't scored many recently. But I have every faith in you to get back to scoring ways. Okay, he appreciates the support. His morale's good, so hopefully he can end the drought. We are going to start him against Stuttgart. We'll have Carrillo on the bench. So uh, hopefully it does does wonders, that team talk, or that individual talk. Of course, last episode we went out of the DFB Pokal, losing 4-0 to Bayern. So nothing else to play for. We're out of the Europa League. We're out of the German Cup. So last four games of the Bundesliga are the focus. So the first game today, an away game against Stuttgart, who are in the middle of the table at the moment. They sit ninth place. As far as the team goes, uh, we are going to start Chaglar in place of Robin Knock. We'll have him on the bench in place of Papadopoulos. Carrillo is a bit tired, so we are going to start Mario Gomez. We're going to leave Yunus Mali up alongside him. Had a good game last time around and scored two goals. Paul George and Tep has been not in great form recently, so Muni Iron is going to start on the left-hand side. I've just moved Bizarre up alongside Max Arnold. So that's the only changes we're going to make. Uh, we're gonna, we need to put a uh, defensive midfielder on the bench. We'll do uh, Gilavogi because Gustavo's just come back. He picked up a bit of a knock in an earlier game. So uh, we'll uh, get rid of Trask. And that's going to be it. So let's send the team out uh, instruction-wise. Going to try and work it in there. Going to be more expressive. Uh, we're closing down more. We'll go for a balanced width. Uh, just play a slightly high defensive line. Only players I recognise from this Leipzig team is the striker Kiesling and uh, Insua, the former Liverpool left back. No one else here that I really recognise a great deal. Uh, we've been on a good run to go out there and impress me. Mali, I'm going to say more of the same. Gomez, I'm going to say I have faith. Uh, and then the defenders in midfield, I'll just say have faith as well. Just a bit calmer. There we go, start the match. Let's see if we can uh, get a win here. We haven't lost since October, so if we can end, you know, have like sort of a good half season unbeaten, that would be brilliant. Why are we on counter? I don't really want that. In fact, let's leave it on there for now. Let's see if see if that helps at all. Turn the tempo up a bit. That's going to be it. Let's see what happens here. We've not got as much of the ball. It's a bit more level now, but 17 minutes. We've had the only shot so far. Okay, counter's not working, so let's go back to standard. Let's go fluid. Now, I've got a free kick of Stuttgart. Here is Mane. Bazoa with the good tackle there. Won the ball. He set Gomez free. Gomez, a little bit isolated, though. Needs some help. Manages to get past the player there. He's still going, and he's... Oh, what happened? I don't know what happened there. Not really easy to see what happened in 2D, but uh, it hasn't gone in. So, uh, that's the only thing that matters there, is that that wasn't a goal. It's not good enough. Oh, here we go. We've got another attack here. Mooney Iron cuts inside. And uh, Gomez, oh, just wide. That would have been the chance to end his goal drought. But a couple of chances there. Hit the woodwork with one of them, apparently. I didn't even see that. Uh, it's half time already. That's gone quite quickly. Uh, 
Keep playing the way you've been playing and the result will come, I'm going to say, because it's not been too bad. Bernadeschi's been a bit quiet, but we haven't done too badly here. No goals, but Stuttgart actually haven't had a shot yet, so uh, that's good. We've been defending well. We've controlled the game, we just haven't scored yet. Corner by Mali. It's held on to by the goalkeeper. Uh, I'm going to try and control the game, seeing as Stuttgart aren't having a lot of the ball, really. Here's Jan Horn, back to the goalkeeper. Here's Eunice Mali. Manages to find Gomez. Oh, why? He could have he had plenty of time there. Why did he shoot first time? And the rest of you, I'm just going to say, get creative. We've got a highlight happening here. The corners are going straight to the goalkeeper. They're not really being very good with their corners at the moment. But Stuttgart still haven't had a shot. So, you know, as long as we keep going like this, we won't lose. Played forward there. Here's Burkai Oskan, though. They're coming forward for the first time, really. And uh, it's a foul by Jan Horn. Referee's going to give him a card here. Please don't be red. Don't be red. Okay, no card. Fine. But uh, still got the free kick here. What are they going to do with that? Not a lot. And now we're on the attack. Mario Gomez. Come on. Chagla. To Bernadeschi. He set Gomez free. Come on, Gomez. No, the defenders got there first. Headed forward. Mali. Gomez. Cleared. Only as far as Korcha. Here's Chagla. Korcha again. Gomez. Mali. Richly Bazoa. Go on, Bazoa. There we go. It's a goal on the hour mark. 59 minutes played. We've looked like scoring. We've had a couple of decent chances. And we've finally broken through. 1-0. Eunice Mali. Playing through Richly Bazoa. Took one touch. Took it left. And then left footed. Past the goalkeeper. 1-0. Good goal. Good tackle there by the uh, Stuttgart player. Berko Osgans through. Could this be their first effort? It is their first shot. It's on target. I'm going to go back to standard, seeing as uh, we are now leading. But we've not been too bad. Gomez has been okay. He hasn't scored again, but he's getting involved. bernadeski has been kind of quiet, though. We're going to bring Blachikovsky on, on the left-hand side. Can I play him a little bit deeper, actually? You know, he's getting on a bit. He's not going to be as quick as he once was. Going to play him as a wing support alongside the midfield, too. Uh, going to go to a flexible shape as well. Gilavogi's on for Max Arnold. Maybe defensive midfielders are better than ball winners. They might not get as many cards. Late corner here by Stuttgart. It's held on to by Rajkovic. It's been a very cagey game this, uh, but we are still winning. If we can get another goal, that would be brilliant. Here's Mario Gomez, Eunice Mali to uh, Jan Horn. And the left back's been dispossessed, but uh, Bruma recovers possession. Here's Chagla to uh, Gilavogi. Korcha. Gilavogi again, Bazoa, Mario Gomez, finds Eunice Mali. Mali could double our leads and it's not even on target, that's poor. Okay, not long left in the game, Gomez off, Carrillo on, last change made, going to play structured. I mean a 1-0 win is enough, we've got a free kick here, Jan Horn with a goal, I think that might be his first goal, it is his first goal, and uh, now the game has been won, 2-0, only 5 minutes left plus injury time. Blazikowski with the free kick, and then uh, headed towards goal by Chagla. Jan Horn with the uh, the free finish, really, the free effort. Late corner here by uh, Stuttgart. It's headed clear by Chagla. Gilavogi will chase this. We could get a third before full time. Guido Carrillo loses out there, though. Back to the goalkeeper. We're 2-0 up. There's not long left, so, you know, this should be a nice win. Just going to go defensive, just to play safe, and uh, well, hopefully to see this out with a clean sheet. Oh, Bazoa's through again here. Bazoa. Oh, that's brilliant. And it's 3-0. Game over, definitely. Now, I've not the microphone. Professional as ever. Fourth goal for Bazoa. Coming along coming along really nicely. First time we've ever used him a football manager. He, you know, he's a bit of a wonder kid. But he's done really well here. Bazoa chips the goalkeeper. I mean, that's as cheeky as you like, isn't it? Chipping the goalkeeper well off his line. 3-0. I mean, defensively today, we've been fantastic. Really, really good. It took a while to get going. Three second half goals, but we've got a big win. That's a good result. And a late, late free kick is on target there by Stuttgart. But it was cleared. And a full-time whistle about to blow. There it is. Stuttgart nil, Wolfsburg 3. A fantastic win, really. Took a while to get going, but that was a good performance. And that's actually secured Champions League proper as well with that. So that's fantastic. We're four points ahead of uh, Schalke now. And we're still six behind Bayern, so we'll see what happens with them. They could drop points again, who knows. 
Schalke dropped points again, so that gap's even smaller now. Three points with us still to play. So they played on the Friday. We play on the Sunday, so we may well find out how Bayern do before we play as well. Yeah, Bayern are away at Augsburg, a team that we drew against after throwing away a 2-0 lead. Also the game in which Simon got injured for the rest of the season. So let's see if Bayern drop points. They do drop points, a 1-1 draw. So that's made things very interesting that they're now seven points clear. There's two games left. So we have to get a result against Darmstadt to still be in the race. If we lose, then uh, it's all over. So uh, we have to get a result. I mean, a draw means that they'd have to, Bayern would have to lose their remaining two games. We'd have to win our last two. Uh, if we win, though, we keep the pressure on Bayern. So we have to win this game, really. Alrighty then, Darmstadt away. Now the team did well. Broom is suspended though, so we'll bring uh, Nock back into the first 11. Papadopoulos on the bench. Uh, team's looking good in fitness wise, so I'm not going to change too much. Bernadeski's been a bit quiet. Blasikovsky came on and made a good impact. So we're going to start him today. Going to play him um, in that wing role that we played him in last time as well, on support. Gomez, I'm going to keep faith with him for this game. You know, I back him to score a goal, so we'll see if we can. Pick up where he left off, I'm going to say. You know, we did well last time around. Mali, just continue what you're doing. Same with Bizarro as well, more of the same. And then Mario Gomez, passionately say, I want to see a good performance from you today. Start the match, Darmstadt away. If we can win, keep the pressure on Bayern. If we lose, the title race is over. So, uh... A good result, please. Darmstadt, I think we're in the relegation zone as well. So we should be doing well here. They're in 16th. So at the moment, they're in that relegation playoff place. So uh, if they stay there, they'll have to face a team from the second tier. Just trying to stay in the division. Going to control the game. We've got the possession. Go fluids. See if we can uh, find a goal before half time. 20 minutes. No goals, but we've had six shots. Darmstadt, zero. Going to turn the tempo up. Going to play wide again. Stay on our feet as well. We've got... Going for tackles. Got a throw in here. Mooney Iron on the ball. Here is Max Arnold. Back to Robin Nock. Here is Chaglar. Max Arnold. Bezoa. Gomez. To uh, Eunice Mali. And then uh, not a great pass there. Still got the ball though. Can we build another attack here? Chaglar to Arnold. Blaszczykowski ahead of him. Finds him. Blaszczykowski to uh, Richly Bezoa. Bezoa still going and he's found a goal. Twice in as many games, and we have a 1-0 lead in the 40th minute. Replay then, Blaszczykowski to Riesley Bizarro, taking it round the players, and again with the left foot. I mean, the goalkeeper there is, uh, well, it's, it's laughable goalkeeping, isn't it? We have a lead. Blues how things are going, keep it up, I'm going to say. Because, you know, I'm happy with how we're doing. So we'll leave it at that. I'm just going to put the defensive line back to normal, seeing as we're winning now. That's going to be the only change like, to the tactic, really. Can we get a nice... Easy, nice, quick second goal. Then we should have no problems here. Darmstadt, one shot. No, they've had a couple more since, but we're playing well. I'm going to go into the team to just encourage the players. If we can double our lead, then it'll be a bit more comfortable. 1-0 is a bit nervy sometimes, but we've not created a great deal of attacks again. The strikers are being a bit... got the low ratings again. 6-5 and 6-6. Six, six. Mali to uh, Max Arnold. Here's Bazoa. Mooney Iron. I want a goal for Gomez. I just want to go miss a score a goal. Jan Horn to Mooney Iron. Mali. Max Arnold on target, but not in the goal. 72 minutes. Still only 1 0. No changes made yet either. Maybe we should make some subs. But a free kick here for Darmstadt. It's held on to by Rykovic. It's a penalty. Uh, Robin Nock has conceded a penalty. There was a push. Uh, who's taking this? It's Schmidt. Darmstadt equalised here. This could be the end of our title race. Oh, he's in. I mean, Rykovic didn't even move. It's unlucky. We've conceded a penalty at a pretty bad time, actually. We could have been 2 0 up, but unfortunately, we're now drawing. Rekovic didn't even move for that. Okay, gonna make some changes. I'm gonna bring Mali back to the middle. Gomez again has just not really done anything. Carrillo is gonna come on uh, as, yeah, leave it as hack. Suddenly, we're drawing. I mean, if Starmstack get a winner, that's our title race over. So, uh,. We need to do better. Mooney Iron has it here. 79 minutes played. It's a foul. Uh, it's a red card for Cohen. Darmstadt down to 10 men. Last few minutes of the game. Right, we've got, got some changes to make. Mali, been not great today. Dadaiva's going to come on. 
We're also going to take off Arnold and bring on Gilavogi. It needs to be a late one if we're going to get a winner here. I mean, the draw is pretty disappointing, really, and the time's run down. It's going to be a draw, which is a really bad result. It's, that's, that's annoying. A penalty as well. We should have won that match. We really should have done. Uh, so that now means that there are six points between us and Bayern with six to play for. And their goal difference is miles better. So I feel like that's the race over. It's a shame. But unless Bayern lose both their games badly and we win our, both our games emphatically, we're not going to do it. So uh, we're not going to win, I don't think. I mean, second place is looking good. We're four points clear of Schalke. So it's going to be a second or third, but we'll see what happens. I'm disappointed we didn't win that. We really should have done. So Bayern have effectively won the league, haven't they? I mean, they've got... How many more goals have this good than us? 21 more goal difference. So a 21-goal swing pretty much means that we need to win both our games 5-0. And then they need to lose both of those 5-0 and have won 6-0 as well. That's not going to happen, is it? So uh, Bayern have effectively won the league. So, you know, it's just about trying to stay second now. Schalke are four behind us. So, uh, secure in second place now. We're four points ahead. So, if we win one of our two remaining games, then we've secured second place. Uh, so, if we win one of our remaining games, we'll secure second place. Two draws, I think we'll also do it. That would depend on goal difference. So, um, yeah, we should be all right. Uh, Bremen, we have, who are in sixth. And then Leverkusen in fifth. Two tough games. So, that's going to be difficult, but... I'm confident we can secure second place. But that's going to do it for today's video. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, leave a like down below, leave comments. And if you want to see videos as and when it's up on YouTube, do hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you next episode. Uh, the final episode, other than maybe a couple of look ahead videos, which I'll do. I always like doing those. It's going to be Bremen and Leverkusen, uh, the final games of the season. Let's see if we can secure that second place. Thank you for watching. I'll see you soon. Goodbye.